22nd marks the annual celebration of Earth Day. The Miller Park Zoo is inviting you to the largest Earth Day celebration in North America. And that sounds pretty big, and it's right here in Central Illinois. We're here with Shannon Reedy and a very special guest from the Miller Park Zoo. Who do we have here? This is Luna. Luna's our four-year-old barn owl. And Luna has been very excited since um, you've stepped over here. So tell yeah. us a little bit about Luna. Well, it is her first visit to a television studio, so oh, there's well, lots well, of cool well, things Luna. to see. Glad to have you she is all. a star in her own right, but generally in the out of doors. Um, she's a local girl born at the Scoville Zoo in Decatur, actually. So she's been with us since she was just a young one. Aww. She's and, beautiful. Um, yeah, yeah, isn't she gorgeous? She is. She has, it looks like a certain kind of marking pattern there on her breast and mm -hmm. on her wings. Yeah. Does that help her blend in with Abs the environment? Absolutely. Owls are known for their camouflage. I'll turn her around so you can get a better view of those feathers in the back. Yeah. It really helps her blend in with the woodland that she would be native to. Um, in fact, these are these birds are found all across the globe as barn owls, which is kind of interesting. Most animals don't translate that way across um, across continents, but barn owls yeah. do. But that being said, they are endangered in Illinois. So that is um, something that the, the um, wildlife organizations are working on and trying to set up nest boxes and get them really anxious about being here in Illinois again. Well, and I'm sure you guys are pretty well connected to that, too. Yeah, what's, in, what's causing the endanger to, is it habitat? That's habitat is really the big deal for them. They nest in tree cavities, and so with trees and forest um, cut down to make room for farmland, that was kind of an issue, but then the barn owls adapted and they became barn owls. Oh. Barns provide that same kind of a quiet cavity for raising a family and they really well um, that that really just filled that niche for them. Yeah. But now the old barns are disappearing. So we have um, kind of an issue again with them and their habitat. Yeah. Another reason to preserve your old barns. <laughs> exactly. Not just because they're part of our historical That's heritage. Right. That's yeah. right. Okay, so Earth Day is coming up. We've got a big party planned. Yeah, party for the planet. Um, it's an AZA sponsored um, event and Miller Park Zoo takes part in that. Um, it's our basically our big Earth Day event and we think um, that everybody should just come out and learn a lot more about what steps we can take, the things we can do that are easy and fun. Um, lots of different organizations will be part of that event. Um, different Bloomington Normal and Area organizations are going to come out and be represented. Um, Messner, Buster Gardeners and um, some beekeepers. Um, oh, cool. Yeah, the bike club is coming out to do some bicycle checks, make sure we're all ready to ride. Yeah. This the spring and summer, so now, it'll be a lot of fun. Yeah. So for folks who haven't been to the Miller Park Zoo, tell people where you are in town and what and what, some of the things that that are going to strike their fancy when they go there the first time. Absolutely. Well, we are located on the west side of Bloomington, it's Torrick, West Bloomington, in the middle of Miller Park, which is a very large, really fun park. Great green Great space. Great other, other spend, things to see in the park. You can there spend too. the it's whole beautiful. day. It's wonderful. So the zoo is just an, 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 an a wonderful element to the park. Uh, we have lots of different animals to see. <laughs> <laughs> She's so excited. She loves Heather. She does. <laughs> so yeah, uh, we can. You can come out and you can check out Luna and uh, lots of other birds. We have uh, rainforest at the zoo, which is always cool. Uh, we've also got large cats, tigers, and snow leopards, and yep. our oh, and our new most famous residents three baby otters, oh, that's which right. won't be out yet, but you can see them on a monitor for the next few months until they cool. do get to come out and, and romp in the yard. And We're excited get, about and that. And you get to come see Luna. Absolutely. Right. Yeah, she's beautiful. Look at that. She's trying to give you a doll, like, right? Yeah. Yeah. I think. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, Luna, you did a great job on your first TV appearance. Yes. Yes. Yeah, right? She did. Yes. Good stuff. Shannon, thank yeah. you very much. Oh, we it's my pleasure. It. Shannon yeah. Reedy with the Miller Park Zoo. Hey, you can check out all their information via our website. Just go to CILiving.tv and we'll get you connected to the biggest party on the That's planet right. for We're Earth partying. Day. partying. And up next, we are partying with a warm dish from Mary Ann's Diner. And later, did Joe Barlow start a donut war yesterday? I hope you saw the April Fool's Day yeah. prank where our own Drew Wilder got Joed. <laughs> we'll have to check it out in today's CI Snapshot to find out. Stay with us.